Everybody, this is Anne and this is our first K-Food edition. So for today, magluluto po tayo ng isang instant tukbuki or instant rice cake galing sa Yopuki, Korea. So let us check kung ano ang laman nitong isang 240 grams instant packet ng tukbuki. Actually, dalawa lang yung laman niya. First one is this rice cake or tok in Korean. And itong cheese powder, 20 grams each. Yan, 2 gay, 2 pieces. So, kumukulo na yung ating water. So, pwede na nating iligay yung rice cake. So, may something tayong nakita dito sa loob ng rice cake. Ano to? I believe this is desiccant. Ayan, kasi may do not eat. Usually talaga sa mga ganitong pagkain, dapat talaga may desiccant to remove its moisture kasi baka magkaroon ng molds. So let us just wait para malagay na natin yung cheese powder. Lagay na natin yung cheese powder and para hindi dumikit yung ating rice cake or top mix natin siya. And pinaan natin yung apoy to prevent um, na mabilis mag-thick yung sauce. Mas masarap yung tokbuki kasi na susuhop yung lasa sa loob. So this is the packaging. So parang matte glossy finish yung kanyang appearance and you can't easily open this one like kailangan mo pa ng scissors or knife kasi I tried using my hands or and yung nipin ko hindi talaga siya ma-open. And I believe mas maganda siya especially if you have imported products kasi mahihirapan mag-penetrate yung mga insects and pests sa loob ng product. So ito naman yung nasa likod niya. Majority of the instructions is in Korean but of course yung instruction for how to cook is in English naman. And there are only two steps. Again, first is magpapaboil ka lang ng water. Then ilagay mo na yung dalawang ingredients which is the rice cake as well as the cheese powder and hintayin mo lang mag simmer. And finally, the finished product. So, dalawa kami nag-taste test nito. Ako and yung katulong namin sa bahay. So, par hindi bias. Kasi mahilig ako sa Korean food. But siya naman, mahilig din naman siya sa spicy food. So, for the taste, medyo overpowering talaga yung cheese niya. Probably because parang pulang ata yung water na nilagay ko. Just like sa photo, medyo thick siya tingnan. And I thought cheesy lang talaga yung flavor niya. But... Just like the original tteokbokki, sweet and spicy. 
And also, hindi ito siya yung klaseng spicy na, oh my gosh, kailangan ko talaga ng tubig now na. Probably siguro nasa pagka mild spicy siya. Yung sa amoy naman, same pa rin siya sa flavor. Cheesy and spicy yung maamoy mo. Pero hindi siya yung klaseng spicy na masakit sa ilo. With regards to appearance naman niya, based sa photo, it tastes good than how it looks. So parang ganito lang naman din yung mga binibenta sa mga Korean restaurants. And that is it for this video guys on how to make an instant tteokbokki from the brand Yopoki. Thank you very much for watching. And please do follow all my social media accounts on Instagram is at kwdecides and on YouTube at kworlddavao. And also don't forget to follow our online shops account. On Instagram is at kworlddavao and on Facebook is at kworlddavao pero yung naka-display na name niya is kbeautyworlddavao. As doon po kami nag-upload ng mga binibenta naming everything Korean. Shoot!